we were going to mi microblast the rock in a cave, and the microblasting equipment didn't work, so we used these instead. It was, a two, it was about the 2,000 feet above the trailhead that caused us to uh, bring along two technologies. <laughs> Hear that sound, how it's getting higher and higher pitched? You'll start hammering that in, and then all of a sudden it'll get lower pitched. And that means that the rock is starting to fail. And here, you notice there's a fracture line developing. Mm -hmm. If you don't get in a hurry doing this and just let the stress of the rock move, it's more efficient than you're just sitting there banging back and forth. Sounds like you got bad pitons there, Mark. Yeah. I know. My piton just failed. <laughs> now, other than drilling that hole, did I use a lot of force to split that rock? So. Let's see what happens on this one on the edge.